Grace, how did you come to school this morning? By bus. Okay, fair enough. Daniel, what's your favourite colour? Green. Green. So you came by bus and favourite colour green. Thanks, guys. Came by bus, favourite colour green. Bus, green. Bus, green. Green. Those two concepts are talking about different things. One's talking about how Grace came to school, the other one is talking about what is Daniel's favourite colour. Different concepts. In much the same way, the word Claire has nothing to do with colour. Here are some containers. This container is Claire. This container, this volumetric flask, is also Claire. This bottle is green. Wait, hang on. Yes, it's green, but who cares? It's still clear. It's green, yes, but it's clear. This container lid and the actual container are both clear. This red circle, it's red, but it's clear. Here's the thing. Clear means that you can see through it. I can see through the lid of this container. I can see that there are cards in there. Gee, I wonder what the game is. Well, luckily for me, the bottom of the container is also clear, and I can see that it's Uno. This disc happens to be red, but if I hold it up over the lens, you'll note we can still see through it. it gives everything that instant sunset uh, look, but it is clear. That just means I can see through it. So all of these containers are clear. Look, I can see that there's actually some water in my water bottle. I can even see that my fingers are on the other side of the water bottle. Okay, so I can see through it. That's what clear means that you can see through to the other side. It will let light pass through. The lid of the container, on the other hand, won't let light through. That's not clear. That's opaque. This lid is opaque. The lid of my water bottle is actually opaque. The bottle itself is clear. Okay, this desk is opaque. The whiteboard is opaque. I can't see through it. So clear is simply a different way to say transparent. This bottle is transparent. The volumetric flask is transparent. They will let light pass through. But that says nothing about colour. The colour here, green. Here we have orange, we have a green container, we had a red disc, we have a greyish disc, we have a white whiteboard. Now in the case of these containers, Claire doesn't talk about colour. What is their colour? Well, they don't have one. So we say the colour is colourless, as in there is no colour. So clear just means you can see through it. It will let light pass through. You can see what's on the other side. That's clear. Colour is different. Okay, so that's green, that's orange, that's green, that's red, that's colourless. So you could describe some water as a clear, colourless liquid. It's clear, you can see through it. It's colourless, it doesn't have colour. In fact, water actually does have a bit of colour. I know most of you think it's colourless, it's actually a very faint blue colour. But that's a video for another day. Don't forget to hit the like button. Yeah. And subscribe too, it's up here. And here's another video.